Okay, this is problem number seven from wastewater collection math from sewergeek.com. This problem says what capacity blower is required to ventilate a manhole 60 inches in diameter and 53 feet deep if three air changes are required every six minutes? Okay, it complicated this one up fairly decent, but it's not too bad. We're going to simplify it. It's CFM are the units. And I'm going to go ahead and rewrite that again as cubic feet per minute. So I need to find the feet cubed and the minutes and divide it. And that's going to equal my cubic feet per minute. There's my formula. So I'm going to need feet. So let's get rid of this 60 and turn it into 5 feet. 53 feet deep, 3 air changes every 6 minutes. I think we're pretty good because that's in minutes. So I'm going to go six minutes and put that in there. Let's draw it just because. So there's my manhole. In this problem, we're ignoring the size pipe because it doesn't say it. Maybe it doesn't even have a pipe. Maybe it's just a manhole to go down there for no apparent reason. It could be a wet well. And it's 53 feet deep. And it's five feet in diameter. So we got to figure out the volume of this cylinder. And the volume of a cylinder is going to be diameter squared times 0.785 times the height. And we're going to leave it all in the same units. So I'm going to go 5 squared times 0.785 times 53 feet. Uh, let's see here. 5 times 5 times 0.785 times 53. And that's going to give me 1,040.125. That's close enough. That's in feet cubed because I got square feet times feet, and that's volumes in cubic feet. So it's 1,040 feet cubed. So there we are, 1,040 feet cubed divided by 6, because I want to go cubic feet per minute divided by 6. So that's going to be 173 cubic feet per minute. And then what we want to do is we want to take a look at this and see if we've got everything. Because we're seeing 173 is in the answer, but we don't just grab it, we take a look. And there's something over here that says three air changes are required every six minutes. So in order for this to do three times every six minutes, the fan's going to have to be three times bigger. So I'm going to take 173 feet cubed per minute times three changes per minute and I'm gonna get times three suspect I'm gonna get 520 equals 520 feet cubed per minute so there's my answer it's this guy so just make sure you take a look and make sure you didn't miss anything Sometimes I like to occasionally just cross the units out as I go through and I'll go, look, there's still a three missing. But then look at it, maybe I didn't need it. But in this case, I did need it. I needed to do three air changes an hour. Every now and then they'll throw in a, a number just to mess with your heads that you don't need. It might have to tell you that the temperature is 78 degrees. Just because.